let's talk about the weight gain. Cause, oh, know. yes. People were saying... They've been this saying baby I've would been, have been like what two and a half by now two two two, two and a half ago. but you know what's crazy it's like when I was twenty three I fibbed about being married because I wanted to have my baby and I thought that if I didn't say I was married then I would you know I I didn't want to lose my fans I didn't want to disappoint anybody which is why I just said well I don't want to just go down the aisle just to go down the aisle just because I'm pregnant. I want to be ready to do that. So let's let's just say that I'm, you know, married or whatever, which was the wrong thing to do. I don't think I've lied since then in the press, which is why I shouldn't do so many interviews because all I know how to do now is tell the truth. So, um, but yeah, I would not be embarrassed to be, I mean, I was pregnant out of wedlock then. Why would, if I'm out of wedlock now, why would I be, you know, ashamed of a baby? And like, it's funny how people are telling me that I'm pregnant. Like, first of all, you don't know what's going on right. in my stomach. Like, how you go? First of all, you can't do that. No, what well, I know you. No, you are pregnant. You are. When is the baby due? Like, and it really be like it, that. It's just like, girl, you don't know me to say that, and you don't know what's going on. I think it's. I did. I didn't think the the pregnancy thing was body shaming. Like people were calling that body shame, and I didn't feel that from people who obviously thought that I put on weight and she's gotta be pregnant. Like I didn't take offense to that for years, you know, but it's been years now. I went on a foodcation because I've been eating clean for like seven something odd years in the gym every day playing tennis. I'm like, yo, I'm tired of this crazy discipline. I need something to eat. I want some pasta, I want some pizza, I want some cake. I want something other than salmon, broccoli, and asparagus. Nah, and water every and day and I was like listen day. I I I can't I need right after Roxy in Washington DC mm -hmm. I went on a foodcation I went on a foodcation honey and I'm telling you it has been it has been very tough for me to want to get off of what's your favorite snack or thing to get now on this food foodcation that cake uh the cake that was at that hotel in DC and I love Wendy's Wendy's a uh, number 10 with a strawberry lemonade, large. And I love wow. apple pies from McDonald's, especially overseas, um, because they got the fried ones overseas. But I know that it's time for me to drop. My goal is 15 because I don't wanna go back to that skinny brandy that looked too skinny, I didn't have any boobs and don't have the butt that I have now. I want to keep some of that. I just want a flat stomach, and that's it. Because <laughs> I don't want to be looking pregnant if I'm not. How does it feel, because, you know, dealing with the haters is one thing common, but then you have people like, I think Charlemagne said something on The Breakfast Club. The Charlemagne thing really hurt my feelings. I'm going to be totally honest. Like, people don't get to me. But... Like I said, when people genuinely think I'm pregnant and just don't want to say that I gain weight, I don't, I don't feel like they have bad intentions towards me. That's why it never really bothered me when people would say it. Mm -hmm. But when he said it, he said it knowing that I'm not pregnant. You get what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So I could feel his... So it was like an intention type of thing. It was an thing. intention to hurt me. It was intention to hurt somebody. And then you did it in front of my brother and tried to ask Princess, yo, is Brandy due around the same time you do? No, Brandy is overdue with as long as people live. Well, that's what the rumors say. And then Angela Yee, def like, yo, don't do that, Charlotte. Like, she was real. She really, really had my back in the street. She was like, don't do that, Charlotte. Man, that's body shaming. You can't do that to people. What? What? That's what. And it just. It, it just, it really hurt my feelings because I don't even care about what you said. It's your intention. Like, how can you go there? Like, I'm a woman. I'm a, I'm a, I'm a black right. woman. I'm a mother of a, of a turning 16-year-old. I come from a good family, and I'm, I'm clean out here in these streets. 